I'm Brittany, this is Lanjan, and welcome to Gay Watch, where we watch gay things. Today is episode 16 of Word of Honor. Kind of everything happens so much, we're like right in the middle of the Heroes Conference, so there's a lot of rumors flying around, there's a lot of things being flung around, it's like, and then our boys decided to have a breakup right in the middle of things, and they've gone their separate ways, and there's a, there's a lot that's currently in the middle of happening. So please, for the love of God, let's hit play on episode 16. Jesus, Shen Shen. The escalation was not... Shen Shen should never be a diplomat. Oh, fuck. Yeah, in like every single fucking way. Does Kashin think? That guy was. Yeah! Does he think that guy was the one who was responsible, but it's not actually? <gasps> that would be amazing! There goes the wine. Ooh! The other gay dad enters the chat! Kashink's like, I know we said that we were gonna go separate ways, but I wasn't really listening. I clearly needed double alcohol for this. Too bad I don't fucking have it! <laughs> Guys, give peace a chance! It worked? It worked. Well, it's ruined for like a lot of reasons. He's not riding off into his own death? He's gonna take the fucking deal that the beggar people are for sure going to go back on? Fucking blow me down! Fucking what? Yeah, he has no idea which fucking end is up. Which, same! Wait. Wait. No, no. Pause. Do you, do you mean, do, do you mean, hang on, hey, hang on. Do you mean to fucking Tell me that that dude somehow got away with the real majority of the glazed armor while Gao just pretty much fucking died thinking he was destroying it. Is that, is that what fucking happened? Is that, I, the, I'm, we are taking a second. Okay, okay. I mean, it's not fucking okay, but okay. Okay, hello. Okay, fucking hello? Fucking hello. They just set a new record for shortest breakup, and they already had a pretty fucking good one. Yes. 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 Yes.
like a good boyfriend. Oh. Okay. Hello, robes. Why is he kind of fabulous? Wait. Fucking hang on. So when Ashu mentioned his facade, he wasn't fucking kidding. My brain is like in several different pieces on the ground right now. Ooh. Okay. Super creepy, kind of fabulous. I got your vibe, dude. All right. He is really fucking pretty. Ha! Holy fucking shit. What the hell kind of water holding device is that? That black and gold intricately carved. Fuck off. I need like 10. What? Alright, alright, hey now. Let's not get into the ageist stuff here. Oh! Don't poke Mama Bear! There's a person? In there? There was a boy! Yeah, we have got to motherfucking get her out of there. Is that how we complete the found family? We get her out of there? Can we not fucking say that in front of his daughter? I don't care if you think she is asleep. Also, I'm back to crying over Gao again. What a king. I'm so sorry that I didn't figure it out sooner. Can we let Shen Shen fuck off? God, especially if he's just gonna get mind fucked by this dude. Shouldn't he be dead though? Shen Shen was like, if he dies, I die. I must say, Shen Shen looks pretty good with just a little bit of that facial hair growing in. I'm just saying, I know, I'm shallow. Fucking great. Fantastic. Wonderful. Couldn't be happier about this development. Sure. Fuck. I love that they've just like dropped this chaos uncle, this chaos grandfather into this mix. Like what? Hilarious. Oh! It's that kid! It's 300 year old kid! I did not! I did not recognize him! Why is everything happening in this episode? What? Because he was your fucking dad! The day he admits it. No! Don't you fuck. Didn't I say that this show was really picking up energy and about to like hit its stride and like was about to take off or something like that? Didn't I say that? God, I love being right. But I hate being wrong about every fucking thing else. Is this common for this genre that like everything kind of like starts out, you know, like we kind of get running, we spend the first few, if not maybe like several episodes laying some stuff and then we just make everybody go max capacity the whole time because once again, head full. Is that just like the thing that they do? Because this is my second one and they've done it twice now. I love where everything is going. I love where it has been. I love how we got there. I love how furious I am, shut the fuck up motorcycle, at all of the developments that happened in this episode. Are they countable? I think they're just infinite. I love what this means for Kashing. 
going forward. And it'll be interesting to watch how he uh, adapts around all of this new information. We're kind of already starting to see it, but I can't wait to have that elaborated on even more. I'm going to go freak out kind of about everything. I mean, you already saw me freak out, but I'm going to go like absorb and then probably babble at my wife for like 10 minutes about things that she is absolutely not going to understand. Because that was a lot. That was a lot. And I'm really glad I had no fucking idea that a big episode like this was coming. That's one of the, um, that's, that's one of the bright sides to just like wandering into something with truly no spoilers, no indications at all. Cause like when you hear about a particular episode that's like super loved or super hyped or someone's like, oh, wait till you get to blank episode, you'll freak out or whatever that prepares you on some level, on a very foundational level of like kind of what to expect. You're like, okay, I'm going to get my face blown off when I go into this. And it lessens the impact just a little bit. But I had no fucking idea that episode 16 was going to punch me in the face repeatedly with its plot developments. And I love getting blindsided like that. That's why I'm so anti-spoiler. Not just because of the type of channel I run, but just personally as well. I'm so anti-spoiler because I love just getting clobbered over the head with shit. Oh, it's so good. That's it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. I'll be back on Tuesday with episode 17. And please remember to take care of yourself.